Kabala Gadi Yakapa, E Rabba Kazadi Biki di Baraka Doba La Kazedebe, E Kabala Makola Baradi Yakapala Madua Kapara di Ekelemede, Rebaba Libra Kosadaba, E Kabaru Kazadi Baraka Daba, E Rande Yande Le Mekeba, Le Kabada Baraka Sufada Gadaba. Lift your voice and bless the name of the Lord. Lift your voice, honor him tonight. Glorify him, him tonight. Adore him tonight. There is none like Jesus, none to be compared to him. He alone is worthy. Worthy of our praise. Worthy of our worship. Worthy of our adoration. Lift your voice tonight. Mashe kaba ruske di barakaza. E kaba lama duske di valakaze. Rendo bali kazonda balakadaba. E kaba lama dukaria da balakazu de gede bede gede. Rabba baba li kozi kaba do shende rebe du kazede e kabala rabba kadiba kaba e bala kadaba la kadaba ra makazuva la kadaba ra kaba baba la kadi kado sendoli ya kabe le kababa li brosi kadiba e rabba li kodi para madu akabali le bede bede gadu makabada rabba dagadu makalaba di ya kabala le bronde kele medi ya kabala gadi ya kevele gede bede Lift your voice and bless the name of the Lord. Give him the praise. Give him the worship. Give him the adoration. He alone is worthy. Worthy of our praise. Worthy of our worship. Worthy of our adoration. Kele barama dua kapala dia kapala da raka baba li kozi baraka sanda le kaba li brozi kedebe le kedebe li kada bade le bede mekula bade gaya dabade le barama dia kapala madua kapala daba e raba ba li kazo baranda yanda ba e kabanda yanda ba la kadondi le bedi ya kapada ba. If you just join us, you are welcome to tonight's edition of Standing in the Gap. Lift up your voice as we worship our God. Lift up your voice as we magnify his name. Lift up your voice. Don't forget to share the link and invite a friend. Le ma kapara di kazuva la madia kabalie re ba 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 li brozi kababa le kabo rizando le marakuze debe re kaba li madia kabala da barada le kaba ba 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 Lord we salute your Majesty. Lord, we salute your supremacy. We say you are the King of kings, the Lord of lords, and the beginning and the end God, the Alpha and the Omega. None can be compared to you, O God. None can be matched up to you, O God. Sally, you are welcome. Sally, you are welcome. Maseka Barakadaba. Sandra, you are welcome. Marika Zova Dagada. Benny, you are welcome. Reko Libro Zike Debede. Lift your voice. Honor the name of the Lord. Glorify the name of the Lord. I welcome each and every one online and those here present with me. The Lord bless you even as we make time to pray. Lift your voice, lift your voice. Rakabada. Father, we have come to pay our dues. We have come to pay our dues. Rakandeleberia Kabala Gadaba. We have come to pay our dues, O Father, and to say thank you for the things you have done. Thank you for the many things you have done. Thank you for the things you are yet to make manifest in our life. Reka son delevere. Le keria da bala kazivere medua kabala gadime le kedie keleveria kovaladi. Rabba baba du keze be 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 le kaba babo si arabadaba le kandoli bara masunda li yakabarada rekobali yakabada madi zeke de be de be de kaduma kolaba de ge de be de kudalaba rabba ba li kozi badaba rekondi di bi di yakaba rabba baba baba la kadaba thank you Lord thank you Lord thank you Lord thank you Lord you are worthy. You are worthy. You are worthy. You alone are worthy. You alone are deserving of our praise. You alone are deserving of our praise. Mashe kada ba da ba, rakada yanda labrande kalaba, imalaya diya kapala madua kapala madaya, 
reka bele me duks ke divele me kuveli ya ki leve duma ku leveri ya kabade re ba 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 bo si ya debe 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 e kabara ba do si ya leve di ya ke le me debe le kababa li brozin dala branda kabanda yanda bala kudaba le kabara madua kabali me develi ya ke le me di ya kabaros ze kababa li kaborada randa yanda labada masanda labada gada rakababa li makabarada ya la brande le kedima la varaku la vadi ya ke le me dua kabaladi reko ze vadi gazot le kababa baba rakabada bada ba le kadaba randa yanda ba lord we thank you for our families we thank you for our loved ones we thank you for our children. We thank you for the opportunities and the privilege. We thank you for security and protection. We thank you for preservation. We thank you for watching over us. We thank you for your mighty hand that keeps sustaining us, keeps protecting us, keeps preserving us. Oh Lord, thank you for your loving kindness and your mercy. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I welcome you all to tonight's edition of Standing in the Gap. Hallelujah. And today is day two, day two of dealing with evil gates. Hallelujah. Amen. Yeah, dealing with evil gates. And we are believing God that the supernatural will take over tonight. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. It is my prayer that the supernatural will take over your natural tonight. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says in the book of Isaiah chapter 10 and the verse 27. It says, it shall come to pass in that day that his burden shall be taken away off his shoulder. That thing that is weighing him down. The burden is meant to weigh you down. To slow down your pace. The burden is meant to keep you in one position. But the Bible says it will come to pass that in that day. His burden shall be taken away off his shoulder, and his yoke shall be broken from his neck. The reason is that the yoke shall be destroyed by the anointing. And I declare over somebody tonight that by the reason of the anointing, by the reason of the anointing in Christ Jesus, I declare let yokes be broken tonight. Let yokes be broken tonight. Let every yoke be broken tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the precious name of Jesus, I speak over your life. I declare over your destiny. Any yoke that is holding you down, yoke of failure, I declare let it be broken off your neck. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, programs of failure tonight in the name of Jesus, by the reason of the anointing, let it be destroyed. Let it be destroyed. Let limitations be broken. Let burdens be lifted up. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the pronunciation that has been made over your life. That is weighing you down. That is slowing down your pace. Hindering your manifestation. Tonight in the name of Jesus. By the reason of the anointing. By the reason of the anointing. I declare let that pronunciation be reversed. Let that evil pronunciation be reversed. Let wicked pronunciations be reversed. In the mighty name of Jesus, whatever that has been spoken against you, against your children, against the work of your hands, against your destiny, tonight in the name of Jesus, I come as a covenant servant of the Lord, as a covenant messenger of Jesus, that let that spoken word be reversed. Let the unrighteous statement be cancelled. Let demonic statements be reversed. Amen. Satanic pronunciations against you be cancelled. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And I declare, let the yoke be broken. Amen. 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 Let programs of failure be destroyed. Amen. Let limitations be broken tonight. Amen. Let burdens be lifted. Amen. Any burden that is weighing you down. Any burden that is slowing you down. Any burden that has become a hindrance. Keeping you in one place. Keeping you in one position. Keeping you not moving. In the name of Jesus. I declare tonight. Let that burden be lifted. Amen. Let that burden be lifted. Amen. Burden of any kind. Whether it's a sickness. Burden of sickness. Burden of poverty. Burden of disappointment. Burden of shame. 
building of dis disappointment, building of disadvantage, whatever building it is, I declare tonight, the Bible said, and his building shall be taken away. His burden shall be taken away. Therefore, I declare by the reason of the anointing, let the burdens be taken away. Let burdens be lifted tonight. Let burdens be lifted tonight. Let burdens be lifted tonight. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I declare you will not carry that burden again. I don't know why I'm praying for, but I declare you will not carry that burden again. I declare again, you will not carry that burden again. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will not carry that burden again. I prophesy, you will not carry that burden again. You will not carry that yoke again. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the precious name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Acts chapter 3 and the verse 1. Acts chapter 3 and the verse 1. Makaba la kasadaba. We are reading to verse 2 and then we pray. Acts chapter 3 and the verse 1 and 2. It says, Now Peter and John went up together into the temple at the hour of prayer, being the ninth hour. Hallelujah. They went at which hour? The hour of prayer. They went there at the hour of prayer. Hallelujah. They didn't go at any time, but the hour of prayer. And the Bible said, and a certain man, lame from his mother's womb, was carried, whom they laid daily at the gate. Look at the scripture. They did not lay him anywhere at the gate. Hallelujah. Of the temple, which is called beautiful. So the guy was laid at a beautiful gate. A beautiful gate. If the gate is beauty, the meaning, beautiful, the meaning what is inside is even more beautiful than what is outside. Hallelujah. But the guy was laid at the gate called the beautiful and he was there asking alms of them that entered into the temple. So people were entering but this guy couldn't enter. There was something that was keeping him from entering. Hallelujah. Something was denying this guy from entering. Everybody was entering the gate. But this guy, even though he was in front of the beautiful gate, every day he gets to the gate but cannot enter. Hallelujah. This guy always come closer to the beautiful gate. Everybody is entering, but he's not able to enter. But I pray for you tonight. In the name of Jesus. Anything that is keeping you from entering your beautiful gate. By the resurrection power of Christ. I declare may the Lord strip, strip it out of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Listen, listen. The Bible said the beautiful gate. Hallelujah. The guy was not laid anywhere at the beautiful gate. Amen. He was placed at the beauty. Every day they will come and put him there so that he will come and be begging. People are entering there and their life is changing. People enter there and they receive miracles. People enter there and they receive healing. People enter there and they receive their assignment. People enter there and things begin to turn around for their good. But this particular guy, every day, for the rest of his life, they come and put him at the beautiful gate and he's not able to enter. People are entering, but he's not entering. People enter and when they come with blessing, they come and give him no fuel. And this guy, he's standing at the beautiful gate and yet cannot enter. But I pray for you tonight. Uh, yeah, yeah. I pray for you tonight. Anything keeping you from entering your beautiful gate. Uh, I don't know what I'm praying for. But I feel the presence of the Holy Ghost. I declare in the name of Jesus. Anything preventing you from entering. Anything preventing you from entering. Your beautiful gate. Tonight in the name of Jesus. Let it die out of your life. I declare again. Let it die out of your life. Let that thing die out of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I prophesy. I prophesy. I prophesy whatever it is that is keeping you from entering your beautiful gate tonight in the name of Jesus. Tonight in the name of Jesus. By the resurrection power of Christ. By the resurrection power of Christ. I declare, may the Lord separate it away from your life. I declare, may God separate it from your life. May God separate it from your life. May God separate it from your life. It from your life. Say in the name of Jesus. Anything that is preventing me 
from entering my beautiful gate. Oh Lord, as I lift my voice in prayer, let it die out of my life in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Rakabala kasadapa iyakapa likaparados zekedebe lekedebe rabaragadi yakabala gadaba iragadaba lakadaba ragadaba lekaba baba irakaba lakadi yakabaraba rendele bedegedegedegedebe rakababa lagaduwa kabala gadaba rakaba baba baba iadala baranda kanda balagadaba reko baba librozi kabadaba rade balakadaba roski dabala makabala de reke bebebe Lift your voice and pray. Lift your voice and pray. Rakaba da kadaba. Rikaba la kadaba. Anything that is preventing you. Anything that is denying you. Anything that is stopping you from entering your beautiful gate. From entering your beautiful gate. Tonight in the name of Jesus. I declare by the power of the Holy Ghost. Let that thing die out of you now. Let that thing die out of you now. Rakaba la kasaya. Le baraka sadabaya, le brazaka dabara, le kabara diyakaba, abaranda yanda balakaba, ibali yanda banda kunda labara, rekebele kedebe debe de, lebe rekebele leme kuba, irabada gada balaka diyakaba, irababa baraka baba, irakanda ba rabam balada, rabam bali yanda banaba, irakaba lagada ba, le kababa baba baba da. Le kanda la baria kabada rekebe debe le kadebe rakabada ba. I pray for you tonight. You will not remain where you are. E kababa ba ba. Le kada ba la kada. Anything keeping you in one place, keeping you at one place, keeping you in one position. Tonight, in the name of Jesus, may the Lord separate it from your life. May the Lord take it away from your life. In the name of Jesus, rakabada yakade. Le brendo kala barada ya reke be 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 de gade raka ba 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 rika ba la kasanda ya ba ibande le ba kada ba le kaba ra kada ba da ba ikada ba la kado wa kada ba rika ba 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 rika ba 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 le kanda la branda kanda ba ibaranda ya na kanda ba ibala kada ba da kado wa kada ba da irega de ga de ga de ba de ga de ba irega de ba la kada ba da ga de ba iraba da ga Badua kadaba iraba ba 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 in the name of I pray for you tonight. Anything preventing you from entering your beautiful gate, anything keeping you from entering your beautiful gate tonight in the name of Jesus. May the Lord separate it away from you. By the resurrection power of Christ, I declare may God separate it from your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Listen, listen. The Bible said, the Bible said, this guy, eh, uh, from his mother's womb, he has been, he has been, he has been lame. Oya, 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 pache. She said, oh, nante, nye, ye. Hallelujah. Unto me, nante. That was the reason why he couldn't enter. And because of that, they put him at the beautiful gate. They carry him. Look at the way that's scripture. And a certain man lame from his mother's womb. Was carried. In other words, they be only the best in the honor in Nigeria. So if they carry him and put him on a baller, that will be his. That, that because of his situation, that will be his. That will be his dwelling place. They be only the to be a honor in Nigeria. They be only the best be a honor in. Are you are you understanding what I mean? When they put, even if he does not like it, he has no choice because the situation he finds himself allows him allows him to accept whatever condition people put him in. Hallelujah. Amen. I don't know the situation you are finding yourself. I don't know what is making men relegate you at the back of the line. I don't know what is making men to discard you and to take you for granted. But tonight in the name of Jesus, Amen. by the power in the name of Jesus, Amen. I declare may the Lord take it out of your life. Amen. Whatever that be the reason for your life, that be the reason for which you are going through the things you are going through. That be the reason for your condition. That be the reason why men take you for granted. That be the reason why men look down on you. That be the reason why men don't want to help you. That be the reason why men have relegated you. I declare tonight, in the name of Jesus, may the Lord separate it from your life. Tonight, let that thing die out of your life. Tonight, let that thing die out of your life. 
anything preventing you from entering your beautiful gate, I pray for you tonight, whether spiritually or physically, in the name of Jesus. May the Lord separate it from your life. May God separate it from your life. May God separate it from your life. I declare again, may the Lord separate it from your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare you will not carry that burden. Uh, you are not here. I say you will not carry that burden. Listen, it was in the hour of prayer that the story of the guy changed. Hallelujah. The thing was like that until the hour of prayer. Until the hour of prayer. It was the hour of prayer. The Bible said, and they went into the temple at the hour of prayer. Imagine they delayed and they didn't take him early. He would have missed his miracle again. This guy has been in the same position. Today, as we pray, as we join our faith in prayer, anything that has, that has reduced you to the level you are, anything that has reduced you and make men look down on you, anything that has caused you to be in the situation that you are, anything that has made men to relegate you at the back of life tonight in the name of Jesus, may the Lord step into your situation. I say may God step into your situation. I pray for you again. May the Lord step into your situation. May God step into your situation. And may he turn things around for your good. I declare may he turn things around for your good. May he turn things around for your good. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In case it is your mistake that is hindering you, that I declare that may the Lord show you mercy. In the name of Jesus. But if it is a pattern in your bloodline, a pattern, an evil pattern in your family, I, I declare, let the blood of Jesus speak for you now. I say, may the blood of Jesus speak for you now. May the blood of Jesus speak for you now. May the blood of Jesus speak for you now. I declare you will not remain where you are. Your position is changing. Your address is changing. I say, your address is changing. I say, your address is changing. I declare your position is changing. Your situation is turning around. It is turning for good. It is turning for good. It is turning for good. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare you are rising and you are walking out of that condition. You are rising and walking out of that condition. You are walking out of that situation. You are walking out of that predicament. In the name of Jesus. I prophesy over your life. And I forbid you by the resurrection power in Christ. For you to remain in that situation. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. This is a serious prayer. Anything that keeps me in the situation I am. This is not the will of God for me. Hallelujah. Isaiah 45 and the verse 2. King James. Isaiah 45 and the verse 2. Isaiah 45 and the verse 2. I will go before you. This is God speaking. I, the Lord, I will go before you and make the crooked places straight. I will break in pieces the gate. Hallelujah. I will break in pieces the gate of brass and cut in sunder the bars of iron. In other words, when God goes before you, anything that is a hindrance, the Lord will remove it from your way. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Are you seeing the scripture? I, the Lord, I will go before you. And coin a chance, and I will win him. I will not only do that, but I will break in pieces the gate. And some of you, the gate before you is not a wooden gate, oh. it's a metal gate. When will you finish chiseling that thing? Some of you, it's a, wall, it's, it's a wall before you. Some of you, it's a wall. David said, by my God, I leap over the wall. By my God, I run through a troop. Hallelujah. Some of you, it is men who have become gate before you. Some of you, too, it's a wall. Some of you, too, it's a barrier. Some of you, too, it's a wooden gate. But some people, their situation is like this situation. A metal gate. Hallelujah. A metal gate. And God said, when I go before you, I will break in pieces the gate, the, the gate of brass. I, the Lord, I will break tonight in the name of Jesus. May the Lord go ahead of you. I am praying for some. May God go ahead of you. May the Lord be ahead of you. This month and this year, even beyond, may the Lord go ahead of you. And in the name of Jesus, any gate that stand as an opposition, may the Lord break it in pieces. May God break them in pieces. May God break them in pieces. May God break them in pieces. Say, oh Father, in this month and this year, 
go before me and make every path straight and break in pieces the gate opposing my destiny in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice and begin to declare. Rakabada kasadaba, rekabala kasaya diyakapa, rekebe likabarados, zeska duvili yakapa, randoli yakavali yedeve, rende vende ken de vende ken diva, ikele vedu keze vedu makova, rekebe bebe bedu, rekaba baba duakapa, lekebe ruakabali makavade, rekebe bebe irandoli yakandaba, rende veluanda ya, irendo kande lebe rimando lekebera. Raka baba ba, raka bada gada, raka bada gada. Oh Father, in the name of Jesus, raka vali ya kandele verega deve, leka baradi ya kabala madua kabada, iraka bebe bebe bebe, iraka baba ba, irandele beri ya kaba, irabamba nda bamba, irabembe librendori ya kaba, irabebe bebe lega dua kabade be, lega debe debe dua kabade be, lega debe dua kabali ya kadebe de. Rabababu, ikabu rakuza debe. Oh Lord, my God, go before me, go before me, go before me, and break in pieces every gate opposing my destiny. Every gate opposing my destiny. Le kabasa yada barakaba. Jela kabara kazanda baya iraka baba baba ruwa kabala gadaba iraka bala kadaba dagadaba dia kabada iraga dagada bala kadaba dagadi rababa lika baraba ibaraka bada kadia kaba ibanda yanda bamba lagada iraga dagada bada gada iraka dabala kadua kabada reke bebe be rika bada baba iraka bada gadaba ra iranda bala bala gadia kabala de raka baba Baba, iyan deliberia kabada ba, irabada badua kabala madaya, irende bende kunda bande bende kende vede ve, riga badaga, liga da badaba, liga da baya, liga da baragada, abala gada badaga daba, irababa laga diya kabada bada, rebe be be be, lika ba ba be be, lika baraka ba be, libra zuka bada ba be, iraka di baraba ba, irababa badu zebe de bedu, rika baraga diya kabala mad. Dagaya, iraga da be da ga da be dua kaba da be, raba ba li brando li ya kaba, irabanda banda kanda ba, irabanda yanda kanda ba, ibaranda yanda kanda ba, iraba da ga duma kubali ya ke deme di ya ke deme di, raba ba li kaba ba, li brando ke le beri ya kaba, reke be be be, lift your voice, lift your voice, lift your voice, lift your voice, may God go before you, may the Lord go before you, break in pieces, break. Breaking pieces, breaking pieces, the gate uh, opposing your destiny, the gate opposing your destiny, the gate opposing your destiny, Rakaba Baba ba. Le kadaba la kadaba, rekuba la makasada ba, iranda balanda yanda kanda balamada, ibele mekuba la gadi, raba ba ba ba, rakanda la badi ya kabada ba, rakaba ba ba ba, irakada balada ya. In the mighty name of I declare over your life any gate standing between you and your prosperity. Tonight in the name of Jesus, may the Lord break it in pieces. Any gate standing between you and your manifestation, I prophesy over your life, may the gate be broken into pieces. May the gate of opposition be broken into pieces. In the mighty name of Jesus, may the Lord go before you this year. May God go before you this year. And may he make the crook places straight in your f- May he straighten the crook places for you. And may the gate opposing your life, opposing your destiny, opposing your manifestation be broken into pieces. I declare it be broken into pieces. I prophesy again, be broken into pieces. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare over your life. I declare over your life. Any gate opposing your life may be broken into pieces in jesus name isaiah 45 and verse 3 isaiah 45 vakasadaya zekasada valakasa messia davalus kedevede verse 3 45 verse 3 and i will give thee the treasures 
of darkness and hidden riches of secret places that thou mayest know that I, the Lord, which call thee by thy name, I am the God of Israel. That you will know. The reason why I'm doing this is so that you will know. You see, when, when, when your father couldn't succeed, your mother couldn't succeed, your uncles, and then out of the blue, you become the shining light of the family, the hope of the family. You will know, as for this one, it's not my hard work. It is God at work in my life. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. You will know that it is God at work in your life. Oh, amen. amen. Oh, hello. Amen. But first of all, the gate must be broken. Yes, and when the gate is broken, he said, I will give you the treasures of darkness. In other words, until the gate is broken, there are treasures hidden in the dark. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Yeah. Some of you in your family, they will tell you a guy where you come. Yeah. I don't know in your family. Yeah, yeah. There are some special rooms nobody enter. Since the ages. Since time memorial. Your father doesn't even know what is there. But they told him here, yeah, you don't enter unless you are permitted. Yeah. And some of you, those rooms, eh, there are things that have to do with valuables. Valuable things. Treasures has been kept there and the family is struggling. Hallelujah. But the Bible said the gate will be broken. When the gate is broken, huh, that treasure that is in the dark, you, you will receive it. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. He said, I will, when I break the gate, I will give unto you the treasures. Not treasure, or treasure. They said, also. Everyone, na, 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 your great, 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 great grandfather. Yeah. Back then, third to fifth generation, sixth generation. Yeah. And they have kept it uh, till today. And they're not giving. There, there are families, they, be, they, they are gold, and they dig the ground and put their gold in a pot, look for some cloth and put it on it, and, and they hide it. And then the people are struggling. When the gate is broken, when, when the gate is broken, when the gate is destroyed, ah, you will have access to the riches. You will have access to the treasures in the name of Jesus. You will have access to the treasures. Hallelujah. You will have access to the treasures. He said, I will give you the treasures of darkness and hidden riches of secret place. They have hidden it in secret places. But when the gate comes down, Amen. it will be given to you. Amen. <laughs> what others couldn't receive, you will receive it. Amen. What others couldn't manifest, you will manifest it. Amen. What others couldn't become, you will become it. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. He said, when I do this, that you will know. Yes. The reason why God wants to do it is that so that you will know yes. that he is your God. Yes. He is the one that called you by your name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. That you will know that you have a father in heaven. Hallelujah. Amen. When everybody, poverty are striking everybody and everybody is looking miserable and then out of the blue, Amen. God comes through for you Amen. and the gate and the partition and the world that stand between you and those treasures, Amen. they come down and the Bible said those treasures will be given to you. Amen. Those riches will be given to you. Amen. Those honor will be given to you. Amen. Those wealth will be given to you. Amen. I declare therefore Amen. that in the name of Jesus, Amen. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, may the hindrance, may the hindrance between you and the riches, you and the treasures, be cleared in the name of Jesus. 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 Say, Heavenly Father, as you remove the hindrance that stand in my way, give unto me the treasures hidden in dark places and riches hidden in secret places to the glory of your name in Christ Jesus. Lift your voice and begin to pray. I will break in pieces the gate of brass. And when I do that, I will give you the treasures of darkness and hidden riches of secret places that you will know, that you will know, that you will know. Lift your voice and pray. Lekabarada kasadaba, rekabala makuvarada ya, 
Randa la vranda kanda la vranda ya. Randa vrando kende le vrende kende veli. Reke de veli me kuvali yeke levedi. Rabababo si baradi ya kupa. Reko bared de vedus. Zendori yanda banda konda la bara. Ababa li kabara gada. Rakaba li brozi kabadaba. Rake di malava ruske de vele medua kapa. Ibembembe li brondi kandebe. Ibele me kubandebe le bende le kedu. Rike bala gadua kabili ya kuvadi. Rika bababa lika burabada. Raka badaba lika barada ya. Raka daba laka daba daba daba. Laka daba ya. Raka bababa. Raka bababa lika baraka daba. Randa bala kaba la branda kandaba. Irebebebe lua kabara daba ya. Rika daba laka duwa raria kalama duwa rabada. Rede vede keze dede. Lika ba lika ba lika daba. Riga daba ramada ya kabada. Reke bebe bebe. Le kabaranda ya ndaba. Ikabondele ya kandaba luande belebe. Le kabarado wakalime debe de gede 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 in the name of i declare may the lord grant unto you treasures of hidden places treasures in dark places blessings that that belongs to your family that nobody have access to i declare may it be granted unto you in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus what your father couldn't achieve i declare you will achieve it what your mother couldn't accomplish, you will accomplish it. What they couldn't become, you will become it. I prophesy by the mercies of God, you will do well than your parents. You didn't hear that you will do well than your mother. You will do well than your father. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. And I declare you will go places. I, 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 I declare you will go places. I prophesy you will go places. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Isaiah 60 and verse 11. Isaiah 60 and verse 11. Your last prayer. Isaiah 60 and verse 11. Masheke diva kasaya. Le kabo shekoli marabadas. Isaiah 60 and verse 11. Therefore thy gate shall be open continually. After, after, the, after, after God has broken it into pieces. Don't forget, Isaiah 45 verse 2. Uh, I will go before you and I will make the crooked places straight. And I will break in pieces the gate of brass. I, the Lord, the, the gate, I will break it in pieces. When God breaks the gate in pieces, because the Bible says he is the one that opens and nobody shuts. Yeah. Let me tell you, if, if we are going to continue on, on this target, uh, we can continue for a week. Yeah, there are many scriptures that has to do with gate. Hallelujah. Amen. He opens and nobody shuts. He shuts and nobody opens. And this time, God said, I will go before you and I will break, I will break in pieces. In other words, I will open it. Amen. And when I open, nobody can shut. Amen. And he said, therefore, Isaiah 16 verse 11, therefore thy gate shall be open continue. The reason is that God has opened the door. Amen. Hallelujah. I declare in the name of Jesus, may your gates be open continually. Amen. The gate of favor be open unto you continually. Amen. The gate of testimony be open continually. Amen. The gate of blessing be open continually. Amen. The gate of elevation be open continually. Ah, yeah, yeah. The gate of opportunities be open continually. Amen. Gate of miracles be open continually. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. He said, therefore thy gate shall be open continually. They shall not be shut. Day nor night. Even when you are sleeping, good things will come to you. <laughs> uh, even when you are sleeping, I said, good things will come to you. Amen. Beautiful things will knock at your door. In the name of Jesus. They shall not be shut. Day nor night. Look at this. That man. When the gate is open, some of you, the reason why people can't do you good is because your gate has been shut. Yeah. They, don't even, they can't even locate you. They can't even find you. You are praying, Lord, let my helpers locate me. And your gate has been shut. Wherever my destiny helpers are, Lord, let them locate me with a testimony. And then your gate is shut. But when the gate is open, men, he said, that men, that men may bring unto you. When the gate is open, men will bring unto you. 
when the gate is open, men will when when the gate that is standing as a hindrance is standing as an opposition is removed out of the way, men will now bring to you. You see, there are things you will not even pray for. You will be there and somebody out of nowhere. I'm telling you. Let me tell you, there are times I receive some Momo letter. I don't even know who sent them money. I'm telling you, that men may bring you. That men may bring you. And let me tell you, it, it, it's, not, it's not a spirit that is sending the Momo. It's a human being. Yeah. yeah, I'm telling you. When we say miracle money, it's not, it's not an angel that will come and hold. Angels don't use phones. <laughs> uh, I say angels, they don't use phones. Yeah, they don't use phones. Hallelujah. It is God who lay it upon the heart of somebody. Yeah. 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 I remember one of the one of the nights when um, 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 Lipton, what is his name? Yeah. Prince, he came to he came to the office and then he came and then I I prayed for him. Yeah. And then when I prayed for him, he he came back again with some small token. And then I prayed for him again. And then when I prayed for him, he came to share a testimony to me. And he said, Osofu, um, something happened. I don't know whether what I'm seeing is, is the reality or not. In fact, he went, he, he deposited money onto his account, his Momo account. Uh -huh. The amount I can't mention for security purposes. But he said, it's in thousands. He deposited the money onto his account because he had to do a transaction. And he sent the money. He said, when they break, he checked his phone. The amount he sent, the amount is still on the phone. So let's say, for example, if it is 10,000 that he sent, he checked and there's it. Because he cleared the account, he sent everything. Not that he sent and left some. He sent the whole money. And then when he, when, when, Oh goodness. He woke up the next morning. He realized that 10,000 is still on the phone. Ah, so he was surprised. Did the money didn't the money didn't go or rot. So he called the person. Ah, I sent you money yesterday. Did you receive it? He said, "Yes, I've received it and I'm, I've started the process already. I've even gone to cash it out." So, so in his mind, he's like, "Ah, is it empty that is doing mistake? Then let me wait. Maybe somebody said it by mistake." So he waited for 3 days and nothing happened. So he decided to Squander their money. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. Yeah, I'm telling you. There are times I receive Momo, I don't even know who sent it, but the number is there. Me too, I don't call the number. Yeah, it's a number that sent you. Tell you, receive an alert. Yeah, hallelujah. Yeah, sometimes I don't see number at all, but I see that it is sent. It is somebody who sent the money. I'm telling you. That men may bring unto you <laughs> Somebody will be sitting somewhere and then what's the three months like a flash? He has forgotten about you. But when the gate is removed, when the gate is broken into pieces and the gate is opened now, uh -huh, you just be there and you are thinking, oh God, where will I get this money to do this thing? And then God, because the gate is open, God will just take your matter, drop it upon the heart of somebody. And then the person, out of nowhere, the person will just remember you and then for whatever reason, the person will just send you. He, you, he, he did not ask you even whether you need money or not. He will just send. Yeah, and you will be surprised. The amount you were mentioning is the amount the person will send. Yeah, when the gate is open, that men may bring. That men may bring. I pray for you. As the gate is open now, may men bring unto you. Amen. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I say may men bring unto you. Amen. May men bring unto you. I declare from today, men will do you good. Ah, you are not here. I declare men will do you good. Men will prosper you. Men will give you gifts. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say, my father in heaven, let the gate that will favor my destiny be opened continually that men may bring unto me blessings and opportunities in Jesus' name, lift your voice and begin to declare. Raka bada kasada bara, reke be reke siva la gadaba. Le marua kasande le vrendo kule barada. The men may bring unto you. The men may bring unto you. The men may bring unto you. That men may bring unto you. 
that men may bring unto you. Makasha da barako sadaba. Yendele bereke zedebe debe 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 debe. That men may bring unto you. Oh goodness. That men, that men, that men, that men, that kings. Kabarako sadaba la kasadaya. Jiraba dagados. Zika da bereke sendevele mekoba. That men may bring unto you. Ah, I am praying for somebody. That men may bring unto you. That men may bring unto you. When the gate is open, men will bring unto you. 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 Kadiba rakosa debede. Rikasande leberi akabadagada. Rakaba baba baba. Any man ordained by God to be help unto you. To be a help unto you. Any man ordained by God, instructed by God to be a blessing unto you. But for whatever reason, they have forgotten you. Now we declare that let the gates be opened. Let the gate that will favor you be opened. That men will bring unto you. Kayadi varuke sedi varada. Le kova li kazos. Zesko dive le keremados. Rende kisanda bando kalabara. Rekebele kediba kabadaba. Le makabara di yakabada, rakabababa, le kandala brandakada, that men may bring unto you the forces of the Gentiles. Hey, Karabadakata. Somebody, you can hear the sound of my voice. As the gate is open, there is somebody looking for someone to bless with a house. May you be, the, may you be that, that chosen person. In the name of Jesus, I declare, I declare, I declare, I declare. May your path cross with men that have what it takes to shift your life, that have what it takes to elevate your life, that have what it takes to bless your life, that have what it takes to transform your life. That men, that men, that men. Bebe be be lika da ba da ba reke de be de ge de lika ba ra ka du wa ka da in the name of Jesus I pray for you tonight that as your gate is opened in the name of Jesus any man ordained by God to bring you blessings to bring you opportunities to bring you testimonies I declare in the name of Jesus I declare in the name of Jesus wherever they are. By the power of the Holy Ghost, we mount pressure on them. We, we, we mount pressure on them. Any man ordained by God to be a help to you. Any man ordained by God to be, to be a blessing to you. I declare in the name of Jesus. As the gate is opened, we declare tonight. May the Lord mount pressure on them. To bring you that blessing they must bring. To bring you that assistance they must give. In the name of Jesus. Let me tell you, as you are here right now eh, and you don't know where to get your get, get, you don't even know the price of it. There is somebody also has, he has built about a duplex or a three bedroom or four bedroom and is looking for somebody to, to, to dash it to. Yeah, God has told him to build a house and he will show him somebody to give it to. Yeah. But when the gate is shut, they will look for you and look for you and look for you until finally they get tired and they just give it to anybody. But I pray for you. As the gate is open, eh? in the name of Jesus, I declare you will own a house without building it. Amen. Ah, you didn't hear that. You will own a house you didn't build. Amen. You, you will drive a car you didn't buy. Amen. You will own a land you didn't buy. Amen. In the name of Jesus. He said that men may bring unto you. Amen. That men may bring unto you. Amen. That men may bring. Let me tell you something. If God, God will bless you, he will bless you through men. If God will transform your life, he will transform your life through men. If God, if God will elevate you, he will elevate you through men. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, amen. amen. When God said, I have found David my servant, uh, it was Samuel he sent. Hello? Amen. Esther needed a Mordecai. Esther, she needed a Mordecai. <laughs> Elisha needed Elijah. Hallelujah. Amen. God will always use men to elevate you. 
God will always use men to bless you. God will always use men to transform your life. God will always. There is somebody appointed to come and be a blessing to you to, to wipe away your tears permanently. Amen. And when that person steps into your life, eh, you will know, you see, you will not see poverty again till you depart the earth. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray for you that let the gate be open continually. Amen. In the name of Jesus. That men may bring you. That men may bring you. In Jesus' mighty name. Joel 2.25. And then we are out of here. Joel 2.25. And 26. I will restore to you the years that the locust has eaten. When the gate is opened, I will restore. I will use men to restore the years that the locust has eaten. The canker worm uh, and the caterpillar and the palmer worm. Listen, all these are spirits. Now, when we say when we say caterpillar, it's not the one that you see on the floor. <laughs> These are different kinds of spirits, different kinds of demons. Yeah, demonic agents. When they come, they eat. When they come, they destroy. When they come, they, they scatter. Hallelujah. And he said, all those things that they have scattered, all those things that they have destroyed, I, the Lord, I will restore it again unto you. I pray for you, therefore, may God restore unto you all the years that have been wasted. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. May the Lord restore unto you all the years that has been wasted. Years that are supposed to bring valuable things. Years that are supposed to bring upliftment in your life. That it looks like it has been wasted. I declare, according to his word, may he restore it unto you again. In the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody is asking, Pastor, how will he do it? Let me show you. One of the ways that God will do it is that he will shorten the year. Let me tell like, you. Like, for example, Peter has twelve the whole night. He has twelve the whole night. Yeah. When Jesus came to the scene, Jesus restored him. All the struggling, he's struggling the whole night. Nah? He, he, he caught a net breaking fish. The fish filled his boat, filled other boats. Yeah. So something he was supposed to get for a one month, he has been struggling for. Those days have been wasted. But when Jesus came to the scene, he restored. He restored. So God will shorten the year. He will shorten. Something that will take you about six years, he will make it in six months because of the years that have been wasted. Hallelujah. Amen. Yeah. Because of the years that have been wasted. Amen. Imagine, imagine Joseph. He has struggled all his life for over 12 years of his life have been wasted. 12 years of his life has been wasted. He was sold into slavery. He went to be a slave. They imprisoned him. All has been wasted. Nothing fruitful came out of his life. It looks as if said Abraham were wasted. And when God was ready to restore him, uh, look at the way God did it. He brought him before Pharaoh. He took him out of the prison, brought him before Pharaoh. And then at once, on that day, nah, no interrogation, no interview, no job description, no job summary. At once, at once. Huh? At once, at once, no application. At once, at once, there and there, nah, he became the prime minister. He became the prime minister. Huh? To give your life to Jesus. Say this after me. Lord Jesus, I am a sinner. I repent of my sin. I ask for forgiveness. I believe you came to die for me. And on the third day, you rose up and forever you are seated on the right hand of the Father. This day, I accept you into my life as my Lord and Savior. Reign in my heart and write my name in the book of life. Fill me with your spirit. 
thank you for saving me and for giving me 